everybody, welcome back to my channel. I have a thrift haul for you guys, which I haven't done one in a few weeks, and so it's not a huge thrift haul. <laughs> it's something, and I'm really excited to share it with you. Let's get started. Wow, I really don't waste time. You guys always say I jump into things, and I always say let's not waste any time. <laughs> Yeah, but I guess I don't. So let's not waste any time and let's jump into this thing. The first thing that I have for you guys, which I'm gonna show you first because I'm wearing it, is this beautiful linen top. How cute. I love it and it's literally 100% linen. And um, you can roll the sleeves. There's one of these little things, but I actually liked them kind of longer. So it's so cute, you guys, and it's so soft. This was $10, which is quite pricey for the thrift store, but I feel like this stuff you just, you can't find. And the fact that it's 100% linen was just, I just had to have it. And it fit me really great. It is cropped. I know you couldn't really tell with sitting down, but it's kind of like a good crop. It's not like crazy short, but, um, yeah, I'm really excited to wear this this spring and summer and I think it's just like I don't have anything like this and it just kind of has that like little bit of like prairie folk feel which I always kind of go towards but never end up purchasing so when I found this and I really liked it I was very excited to buy it. The next thing I got which I was gonna show you guys sooner but then Easter already passed. I got this sweet little Easter basket for my son. This is just some leftover Easter candy and I put, um, what do you call this? I don't know, little paper that I had in my craft bin already and I just loved it. I love that it was more natural than just like the dollar store, like bright colored, Nothing, nothing's wrong with those, but I just thought why not just get a super cute little basket that he can have for years and years, so. Love that. Sticking with the theme of baskets, the next thing that I picked up is this basket and I've been hanging it up on my wall. I know this was in one of my videos, two videos ago or something, but I didn't officially show it to you. So I've been hanging it on my wall and the only thing is that I'm not really like a pop of color person. So the pink is a bit much for me. So I've been thinking, that I might, I don't know how well it will work, but I think I'm gonna try and paint over the pink with white and maybe then paint over the purple. That is purple, I don't even know if you could tell, but with black and kind of give it like a different look, a little bit more like minimal and, cause I love the design, but like on my wall, the pink is just not vibing. Anyways, but I just loved it and I think I might create like a mini basket wall. I've been thinking about that and just like really mini on and I could show it to you if I end up doing it. But so I might put it together another little like um, thrift makeover video because you guys loved that and um, try and DIY this thing. Next thing that I got is just a comfy, cozy, crazy soft t-shirt. So this is it. It says Barcelona, I'm guessing beach, I don't know, BCN, anybody? Don't know what that stands for, but I like really liked it and I don't really go for prints, but like how cute would this be with summer like tied up in some good shorts? Like I just love that. And also it's super soft. Where's it from? It's like a really fun, cozy, soft t-shirt that I've already been wearing to bed and wearing around the house and like living in it because that's totally my thing. Next two things I am very excited to share with you. I found this really beautiful vintage rug. Forget this, you guys. $8. $7.99. It's pretty small. It's two feet by three feet nine inches. So it's pretty small, but I just loved it. And right now it's just on my floor. What's that? A turd? Oh, my last chocolate. I have it layered with my jute rug. Because it was only $8, you guys might laugh at me, I am <laughs> I am trying to sell it because I don't necessarily need it, but I really loved it and couldn't pass it up when I saw it for $8. So if I end up not selling it, like that's totally 
cool. But if I do, then sweet, just a little extra money. But a lot of you have been asking, you know, where I sell things when I say like I might sell it. And honestly, right now, this is kind of funny, but I just sell it on the Facebook marketplace because I'm a stay at home mom and we only have one car and I just really just don't have it in me to, <laughs> to go and ship stuff all the time. And I just hate shipping. Does anybody, like, is that just me? Shipping is very annoying to me. So Facebook Marketplace kind of works nice. Like if I end up selling something, like somebody just comes and picks it up from my house. And that feels like really doable in my current life. So I'm so sorry that I don't like, I'm not selling someplace where everybody can buy it. Maybe in the future, but just not right now. I'm sorry. And lastly for you guys, lastly, is that a thing? I don't know. I have, oh my goodness, this was, this is everything for me. Chocolate. Poland's here too. Say hi, baby. Chocolate. Yeah. I have this beautiful hairpin leg little stool. So truth be told, I've already started DIYing it. It came with a piece of tile just sitting on it. And I was like, that's, that's just not gonna work. So I've already gotten rid of it. My husband cut this piece of wood. I spray painted these black. They were black, but it was really kind of chipping. It was chipping really bad. And so I took it out and I spray painted it black. And honestly, it just looks like brand new. The only thing is it doesn't have like bottoms. And I looked online and I don't know where I could find something like what could make it kind of you know, not scratchy on the bottom. So if you guys have any ideas what I could do to the bottoms, let me know. So, and then I was at the thrift store. I guess this is kind of an extra thing. And I literally found this. What was it? I guess it was $3.99, but whatever. I think it's still probably cheaper than like at Michael's. So, and it's the perfect size. So now all I need, I have batting already is to like wrap it all with some batting and then find fabric and I have a new stool. And did I say I got this thing for $4. You guys, hairpin like anything could not be $4. Anyways, that is that you guys. So that is gonna be a DIY coming up. That is everything. <laughs> I know it wasn't this huge thrift haul, but I've said over and over, I'm really choosy with what I buy and I'm also a huge like household item thrifter. That's like my jam. I love, oh, so good. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's thrift haul. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up. As always, you guys can subscribe. You guys are so great and I'm so thankful for you and all your feedback and all of your kind things that you always have to say. So thank you guys for watching. <laughs> That's it. Okay, bye guys.